guys, we're going into episode 3 in season 1 of Walking Dead. I think the audio cut. What the heck? Yeah. <laughs> Took a while to finally do this, but I'm ready. Last episode was pretty messed up. With cannibals and all, but it could only get worse in this world, <laughs> especially because of Telltale. <laughs> How messed up their stories could be. Walk Dead, Episode Three. Oh crap! Yep, I definitely remember this beginning. It's probably one of the most messed up ones. But I'll try my best to do what's right. Long road ahead, that's for sure. <laughs> Looks like this is our lucky day. Uh, yeah, let's be excited. We deserve it after last time. I wonder what happened last time. What? What was that face, dude? <laughs> you made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of making. I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. Uh, I think we should go. go. Motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Damn Kool Aid. The rig the pharmacy and scrape together whatever supplies are left. Damn, what the hell happened to this place? And we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Probably. And you should probably not be climbing that ladder. After getting shot. Shit. You okay? Oh, the God. Come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Yeah, we should find people. Ooh. Helicopter. So much for the military. Oh well, yeah, what the fuck happened here? By all the fallen concrete. Damn. I wonder if Doug is still in there. God sakes. There's no <laughs> safe way through that mess. Definitely not. We could climb that though. Actually, no, never mind. That's way too tall. Kenny, come on. Maybe. Oh. Ah, uh, shit! Damn it! I can't read. What? Sorry, okay man. then. All right, stay put. I don't even remember that option ever being there. Barrel. Hmm. Alright, I know that's the way, but let's check out this. Hmm. Mm hmm. Interesting. Why is that there anyway? Weird. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Wait, is there actually anything back here? Oh, mm, mm. All right, let's push this jeep. Mm. <laughs> oh, damn it. Oh, there we go. Flat tire. It's completely flat. Let's pull this. Not doing so good, huh? Uh, yeah. I'm worried. 
Don't want to piss him off either. There's a lot to be worried about. She's gonna snap. Surprised she hasn't. <laughs> Excuse me. Wait, I could have just tried that the entire time. Probably shouldn't though. There we go. Gosh dang it. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. Yep, let's start the sky. Baby. The girl's still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon. Uh, I hope oh, not. I hope it ain't worth a damn. Wait. Is that even... Eh. Whatever. Duck was asking about Not much of a difference there. Last night. Oh, that sucks. I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Why would you say that? It was this? a scary situation. Yeah. For him. Those other decisions were horrible. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, please. Gosh dang it. Jesus, are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shocked. Now get off here. What? Why are you so rude? Oh my lord. She bit already? Somebody help me! Oh god! They just run. What the hell is that? A walker? Uh, no. Definitely not. Well, I mean, they could, I guess. Uh. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We've got to do something. Holy shit, man. She's dumb. Put her out of this misery. No, we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive. She draws them all to her. Buying us time. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Mmm. No, sorry. Not happening. I have to. Suck, man, you're not hitting anything. Okay. Oh, I meant to shoot the walker. Oh, I am so sorry. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Oh my god. I should still be going for the corpse. But yeah. Pretty sure I shot those walkers a few times before. But it didn't work that time. Guess it was too close. Holy shit. Those guys have nowhere. I mean, those other walkers didn't even have a way to get to us anywhere. We would be fine. Except for those ones. We should probably kick their asses first. Yep, sorry. Let's get all that, all those supplies. Yep, I'll try my best. Uh, okay. Grab the shit. Grab the shit, Lee. There was this much stuff there last time. Why didn't we just take it all? Grab the shit, man! Yeah. 
Looks like damn well Freddy Krueger. Damn, there's so much stuff. Like, holy crap. Okay, jump. Holy shit. Hey, come on. What the fuck, dude? Oh my god. Why? I told you so much. What? Why should I do that after that? That's bullshit. Oh, thank you for that, though. Run. Oh, shit. Ugh. Do I only have like two bullets? Hit him. Shoot him. Okay, go, 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 go. I mean, there's an army behind us. Run, dude. What the fuck was that? They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? Well, whatever. <sighs> Damn it. That's a lot of damn arrows. Oh my god. I mean, if we had a crossbow, that would be good. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, so nice. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Huh. Oh, boy. So, what did you get? Uh, just what was left. Which was not a really. Actually. Take a look. <laughs> That's a total lie. <laughs> fine, by the way. We I grabbed barely anything. Going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. And that's all beside the fact that Macon is busting at the seams with walkers. We have to go eventually, Lily. I yeah, that place is quite yeah. shitty. Eventually it's different. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. Ken, we're all losing it with the attacks and lack of food. We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. Mm -hmm. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No. Because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We got plenty of food from that station wagon. We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything mm -hmm. that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What? Do you what? Mean? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. Stupid. Instead of what? Letting her suffer? You guys couldn't try to save her? 
You shot her instead. I couldn't let her suffer. We're all suffering. Someone That's true. <laughs> we put our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Y'all should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not so easy for him. What? Walkers and the people Earth, and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road. How would you know? What I know? Murder. I know somebody has been stealing our sobriety. Stealing, and I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now mm. everybody get out. Even me? Damn it. Cock blocked. Uh. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! I think she did, though. <laughs> oh, things are coming to a head. Definitely. The things are going well, crazy. Good today, and I find myself thinking that most days. Oh, yeah? It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. Ooh. With her Thank wound you. up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Of course, any time. Go see Lily first. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Uh, to cuddle you. Um, uh. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Yeah, Do that. you know what's going on? I don't. I just nope. heard you mention it. Thanks. Hmm. For real? Who? Oh, what do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. Counts off, and it's the good stuff. What? Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, mm. we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you're using it when you shouldn't. I guess that makes sense. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. No problem. A mystery. Oh boy. Now who duck? I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Hey. Can I help? Could have been worse. What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. <laughs> mm. All right, you're Robin, boy. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? No clue. I don't know. Go look around. <clears throat> Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. All right. Have fun with that. <clears throat> Let's talk to Clementine. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's <laughs> just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> what the heck? Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, that's really something. I'll be yeah. for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? 
I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah. Yep. She thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment, too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Really? Ooh. Thank about you too. About you too. Our group is small. You're small. <laughs> You're a convicted Awkward. killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have That's to tell true. everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're right. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let yeah, people know. for sure. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Oh. Hell yes. Don't call me small. All right then. <laughs> Is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And the batteries might be in backwards. <laughs> it uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. Believable. <laughs> okay. Do you uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. That's true. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time. There are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm going to look into this thing. Good idea. All right, and then see you, Blue. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? <clears throat> We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Huh. Alright, that's helpful. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know. But He's I'm not right, getting yeah. used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Fantastic. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. I may as well be honest with everyone. It's serious. Okay, should I sit down? Come on. Uh... I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. Oh, that gives us a timeline. Oh, shit. No shit. Wasn't for touching kids, was it? 
No, definitely not. Fuck that. Because we got two here. I killed a guy in a fight. Should I be worried? There's anything else in your past that's gonna come out? Uh, no. Good, but you should know. If we gotta make numbers when it comes to a boat, this is gonna matter. What? What? Dude, what are you talking about? What? Oh, oh my God. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. Is it? Can I talk all right. to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? Wait, he's already talking about a boat. Oh my god, what a hero. This one, uh, yeah. On my way to prison three months ago, you've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you uh, knew I was a convicted fella. My goodness, for what? How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, plenty, but it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife. Uh, That's were... enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. Oh, crap. <laughs> no. Okay. I was given Larry CPR with Lily. Kenny came in from out of nowhere and put a stop to it. What did he do? Oh, yeah. Crap. I forgot she wasn't even in there. <gasps> Damn. Uh, not even a word. Holy crap. Gotcha. Everything keeps changing. Yeah. All right, let's talk to Clem time. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Pretty sure she already knows that, so. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember, your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car, and I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. Flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. <laughs> You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and... Maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried, and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay. okay then. No need to freak out, then. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's <laughs> a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. That's true. Uh... Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh, I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Surely. Is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I was, uh, on my way to prison before this. Whoa, seriously? What, um, were you in for? It's not important. Oh. What? Just, if you hear anything, it's probably true. And now you know. Thanks what? for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. It, what? Well, you didn't even tell him anything. What the heck? Okay. Time to find Lily. Actually, wait. Uh, never mind. 
Might as well. Hey. Find anything? Do you ever want to leave here? I want to leave here when we have to, not because of some fantasy of somewhere better. So, you think the coast is a pipe dream? Don't you? We're going to live on the water because we assume they can't swim? We're alive because we've stayed here. That's as far as the discussion needs to go. All right then. Uh... I haven't found out anything. Well, there's yet. nothing to find in here. Ask around. Jesus, investigate. Okay, okay. <clears throat> I'll tell you something. Sure, go ahead. But if it's bad news, maybe save it. Mm. X. I was sent to prison before the plague. Shit. What? Dad said there was something about you. So you know. I didn't know what to know. Well, it's true, and I'm sorry. He treated you like shit, knew who you were, and you tried to save his life. The last thing you need to do is apologize. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. You killed a guy. So what? I bet he was a dick. Well, it, it ruined my life. Good thing everyone else has got destroyed shortly thereafter, huh? Misery loves company. I guess that's true. What the fuck? Alright, let's investigate. Actually, wait. let's talk to Carly. Talk to Kenny about who I am. And? I don't know. Feels like I just gave him ammo, if we ever have to make any tough decisions when it comes to a head count. Ah. Uh, well, don't worry. I talked to Katja. How'd she take it? Just say you talk to everyone, man. I think she's more upset about Kenny. Because of the St. John's? What exactly did he do back there? Oh, don't you start now. I talked to Clementine about things. How'd she handle it? I don't know. She's tough to read. She adores you. Don't worry. I, uh, told Ben. You told Ben? Funny you picked him. Low risk. I take it he didn't know what to do with the information. Not even a little. He's just happy I told him something. True. I told Lily. You were right. She and Larry spoke, obviously. She was all right, though. Well, you're about all she's got left. I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's investigate this crime. Well, what the fuck? That was a weird camera angle. Broken glass from the flashlight. And an X drawn there. Okay. Interesting. Pink. Hmm. Dark. <laughs> a clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. Probably. It could be. It's Without it, though. Shock, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. <laughs> All right. Guess we have to talk to Clementine about that. Hey Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my... Well, my thoughts. And I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. <laughs> That's what it's there for, bitch. Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, of course. I'll talk to her. Are we gonna say the same thing to Kenny? Do you guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, 
That's good. Turn on each other any more than we have. I'll talk to you later. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. Oh boy. <laughs> I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues and Yeah, Duck, I got it. Good job. And what a hero. <laughs> cool. Yeah. That's epic. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. <laughs> That's probably wonder why. <laughs> Have you found anything else? Just the chalk. I also found some bugs underneath the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. Of course not. Okay, I won't. You seem to know a bit about all of this. The chalk, you found the scuff here. This is gonna sound crazy, but you're not involved, are you? No, I'm a good guy. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. I will, I will. Somebody was over here, too. See, I did good, huh? Yeah, duck. Probably. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You but why would they draw chalk lines on the ground? No, no, go look. Yeah. Those bandits gave us hell, but they've been quiet for days now. Hopefully they say that way. Oh my. There we go. Son of a bitch. <laughs> You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. Yep, there we go. Out of my back pocket. There's a grate on the outside wall, and there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Uh, Somebody is killing us. That doesn't sound from good. That supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. Not exactly. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking oh, steal Oh crap. Who the fuck is that? Y'all better get our people out there. there. We ain't what the around. fuck? What do we do? Oh, uh, shit. They're going to start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you? Stall him. What? Just keep him talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the Okay then. <laughs> This may be shitty. Shit. Fuck. For this bullshit. Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors. Yeah. Hold it, asshole. Take it easy. Uh. Why are, are you, you doing, doing this, bitch? Just leave us the fuck alone. Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we got her. That's why. Oh, uh, that's not a reason. Uh. We'll leave you everything. Just let us walk out. That's not what I meant. So you Fuck. Can try to pay us a little visit, leader. Fuck that. All right. I've had enough of this shit. Drew, take these motherfuckers. Christ. Oh, oh my God. Just run. 
through it. And you just go. <laughs> oh shit. What the fuck? Shoot. Oh my god, really? God damn it. Damn it, I wanted to shoot that bitch. No, oh, stay here. down, boys. Yep, I will. Oh god. I don't even know where they are. Got that bitch. Got him. Get over here, hurry! Man, you saved our asses. Get it Yep, get in. Holy shit, that's a lot. Dude, that guy's so screwed. Get up, bitch. Oh no, I'm screwed. Oh. Oh, god damn. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Alright, I'll be taking all of you down. Except for you, that walker's got you. Damn, headshot. Okay, let's take this guy down quick. There we go. Damn, I'm a savage. I got like five people down there. Oh my god. Gosh, dang it. Lily, get in the RV. Screw her. Let her stay. What? No. Shit. Yeah, you you covered that side. Yeah, I got side. Oh, those those guys got him. All right then. Oh, okay. Get him. last chance. Get down here. Damn, those bandits are getting screwed. Jesus, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. I'm fine. Doesn't look like it. I'm sorry. Everything's fine. Everything's then. not fine. We need to figure out how this happened. We just lost everything. Well, we're lucky as shit to have this RV. And nobody died. Cat's head is That's true. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. That's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? It definitely was not We have to get it out of you then. Back off. You are in no position to make demands. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just pointing fingers. I didn't just come up with this. I've had my suspicions. Probably not the best time, Lily. If not, Kenny's right. 
look at what just happened. Holly's trustworthy. She's not a traitor, Lily. Thank you, Lee. She can fight her own battles. Unless there's something going on here that implicates you both. What? Don't be ridiculous. Like, look, maybe we should vote or something like that. Vote? What? Just look. Carly's a stand-up gal, and maybe this was all just a mistake. We need to look at the facts. Let's calm down, we'll eat, and we'll deal with it. Yeah, let's do eat that. Eat what? Stop waving the finger at everybody. We know something's going on, and we can get to the bottom of it if we keep our heads. I know what we found. I know, Lily. I know. Nobody was stealing anything! Was it both of you? What? I've seen you two together. Was it both of you? Look, no. just let me out. I didn't do it, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. Lily, lay off of him. I... <laughs> Shit, what's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. Are you blind? Well, we can get <laughs> this now, then. Ah, oh, crap. Kitty, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. What should be? Out. Oh my god. That shit crazy. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. I'm not gonna take this. You can push Ben around, but you can't push me around. I'm really sorry you feel that way. I'm starting to think maybe it was both of you. No! Ah, this dumb fuck walker! You okay over there? <laughs> Don't yeah, fuck yeah. Walker. Son of a bitch. Ben, you have no other options. Leave him alone. You can tell me it was Carly, and then everything will be right as rain. There's no it way wasn't. it was Carly. It was somebody else. It could have even been someone sneaking into our camp. That's ridiculous. That's what you think? Yes. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. You're the one who asked for a vote. Just for months. Huh, the hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. Just you think any of that is good now? Just let me stay, please. God, please. You're pathetic. Look at you. He's broken, Lily. I can see that. Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this! Shut up, Carl! This is a reporter. Oh, oh my god. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Ben, you have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you! Stop this! You're torturing him! No! Ben! Stop! This is about trust and I've never trusted you. Uh, might as well do this. What? Yeah, it was me. Did that get you to lay off the kid? I think you're capable of being a real piece of <laughs> shit, but I know it wasn't you. Not with her in your life. There! I got him! Please, let's just get back That's in the not RV. happening! You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can oh, hurt you. Fuck. You're just a scared little girl. Get the fuck over it. Take a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. Uh... What the fuck are you doing? You son of a bitch. Drop it. <sighs> fuck you. Holy fuck. Kenny, what's happening? Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I swear. Please. She could be, though. What are we going to do with her? Leave her for the walkers. Ken, Lee! Why? Why, Lily? <coughs> Just get in. We'll figure out what to do with you. God damn It's a bad it. idea, Lee. She's a murderer for shit's sake. Murderer? Lee's killed before and I forgave him. 
You've killed before, and I'll forgive you. Bullshit, you, both you will. Know we You've do been planning to get to me done. this entire time. I was trying you to were, protect though. all of us. Really? I don't have anything left. Whatever. Just get in. Piece of shit. God damn it. Bastards. Rip Carly. <sighs> Bitch. Don't just chuck the gun there. <laughs> God damn it. Lee, a word, please. Oh yeah, sure. Why not? Let's talk to Clementine first. She needs you for something. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll just go up there now. What's up? Is Doc feeling all right? Uh, nope. He doesn't look too good. Oh, fuck. Fight. I don't know what to say, uh... What's the plan? You've never had a bike all of them... Before. All of them sound like bad decisions to say. Keep an eye on him and see what I can do, from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys... What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Uh, okay. Important to stay honest with each other. Yep, really? that's for sure. Clementine, we would appreciate it. Oh god. That sucks. Duck is bit. He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I wonder how that even happened, though. I shot it before I got down on him. What about Carly? Uh. There was no time for a burial. Walkers? Unfortunately, nope. Yeah. Horrible. He should have more emotion than that, Lee. My God. his bike up alongside the truck and jumps into the back and starts beating on him. What the hell? <laughs> three of them are less, but the truck's still moving, you see. Just as he stands up to jump out, it zooms underneath a tree and a branch hits him square in the face and he goes flying out the back. Sounds badass. Ish. <laughs> if he can live through that, I'm sure Duck can live through this. Uh... I mean, that would be ideal, but not gonna happen. Hey, there's a washing machine in the RV. Never noticed that. Oh shit, that actually scared me for a minute.
I'm back. We got something up ahead. A train. Damn it. Roads blocked. Now we gotta deal with this. Yep. I don't know, I think we should probably go another route. Like another road. Unless if it's only a one road area. That's horrible. <coughs> Damn, that's badass. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. Uh, Maybe. Yeah. Afford to do that now. Definitely it's, not now. Seems like a safe area. Walking is brush will stop horrible. Creeping up on us. And I'd like Especially in the situation that we're in now. I want folks trapped in there with me. Yeah. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clint, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? He seems to be lasting a long time, though. Uh, if there's a dining car or something, it's been ducks a bit dehydrated. Like at least over 12 hours. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. All right, let's talk around with everyone. Sitting here tied up like an animal while you guys decide what to do with me. It's not like that. It's better than being on the road alone. Especially what you just did. My god. Alright, let's get out of there. Whoa, my camera angle though. about keeping her in there I cracked a window I sure as hell don't want her out here with us yeah that bitch <laughs> what are you going to do with Lily uh, I don't know something I suppose normal would be a bit hypocr hypocritical of Lee to punish her for killing someone when he's killed more. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah. Yep. She is. Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. Yeah, she was the love of my life. Uh, uh, well, this isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. Rip. God dang it. I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. If only that was the case. Damn it. Have you heard anything out of Lily in there? Not a peep. Not a peep. She's probably in shock. She did a monstrous thing. She did. Let me know if anything changes here. Alright, let's go talk to Benjamin over here. You stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? 
It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods, just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. Uh, you only slightly. Again? Was it? No! Okay, then. Well, yeah. I don't know. Left I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. Hmm. All right, let's look at this rubble. That's one hell of a mess. I'm guessing it won't look no. Never mind. Let's check this out. A mattress. Dirty ass floor. Holy crap. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Excuse me. Alright. A map. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Got us headed. Yeah, damn, that's epic. Ooh, water bottle. I'll take this to catch you. Good duck. Uh, all right, I'm gonna go back there after I open this door. Something's wrong there. Alright, let's get out of there. Ooh, eeny, meeny, miny, this one looks epic. Let's get it. Looks like it would pack a damn well big punch. No clue what that is. Did I open that one? No, I don't think so. Maybe I did. Alright, let's move on from that shit. But what? No. Oh, I'm an idiot. <sighs> I hope I don't have to use it. That's a waste of a bullet. All right, there we go. Never mind. Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. Probably his keys to something. Hopefully. Oh my god. What happened to you, dude? I don't think this guy came back. Uh, yep, yeah, that's so uh, oh god. The light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. Are you fucking serious? There we go, boys. Okay, I'll give you that. We got Kenny on our side. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This horse will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. Uh, don't say that too loud. Wouldn't mind plowing through some walkers. That would be fun. That's the spirit. Try to get this thing started. There's got to be some sort of manual or something. 
<laughs> All right, then. I don't know about that. Man, Probably no man. The girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Oh boy. Man, this could be exactly what we need. Look a map. A bunch of maps about Georgia cities. Nothing about the train. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn. But it's all broken. I can kind of see the indentations from the right. I can't. All right. Uh. I have no idea what to do with these. Let's open up here. Let's see what's over there. Holy shit. <laughs> I was going to say, how do you even get down there? Uh, I thought those things were designed to save lives. No, well, it didn't work this time, I guess. Oh my god, that guy's on. This door's going to hurt. Uh... Let's try this. I can't get at him in there. What? Okay. Let's undo that. You aren't gonna like this. That's an incredibly dangerous dude. Oh my god. It's jaw. And it's face. Alright, let's go <coughs> grab this. Rip Walker. And go down here and Give duck the water and food. Here, I found this. If duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not duck, huh? Yeah, I dislike broccoli. The trouble I ever had Cauliflower. I use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Brussels sure. sprouts. Yeah, a bunch of greens. I found a notebook. <laughs> I think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Let's give you water too. It's water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can <laughs> keep thinking about. Like somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. <laughs> Alright, let's get this pencil. think someone should honestly be checking up on her so she doesn't just steal the RV or anything. There we go. Pencil. Get that banana shit. Oh. There we go. Don't move. Don't you fucking move. I'm not going to hurt you. Come with me. We can take the RV right now. You left the keys in it. Kinky, but... <laughs> no, we can't. I can't let you take the RV. Don't be crazy. You're not letting me take it. Sorry, Lee. I really am. What the fuck? Holy shit! She's stealing the RV.
What? Uh. Fuck! Stop! Oh, we're fucked. Yeah, we are. Maybe, man. Maybe. Hopefully it works. Probably will. Well, we're fucked if we don't figure out how this thing works. Can't spend the night out here. I mean, you could spend the night in the train, but... Duck is still sick, you know. We need to get to the city. The coast. Oh, God. Alright, let's try to figure this out. Go up that side. There we go. Wait, what? This is not how I remember it. Oh, I went out the wrong door. What the fuck? There we go. That's how it is. Alright, let's detach this. It's stuck. I can definitely pry this thing free if I can break it loose first. There's gotta be a better way to do this. Oh, yeah, the notepad thing. Alright, let's get that done. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be Definitely. Able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Okay. okay. Let's do this first. Forgot already. Okay. Notepad. Down, down. Up, up. That should work. Son there we go. Bitch. Whatever you did, let the dash up. So far, so good. Anything else? Now we're talking. Nope, nothing else to do there. Uh, nine. What's nine? That's five, okay. Let's talk to you first. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does.
Nope. This should be it. No pad. Turn left, turn right. All right. And there we go, the train's working. Holy or should be. We're golden. Yeah, we are. Golden. Feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. Uh I have to derail that part, but might as well. It's all yours. Attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. Well, of course, dude. Hey, Kim. What's up? I'm sorry about the RV. Keeping her was my call. This one's on me. The radiator's fucking hosed in that thing, so she won't make it 30 miles. We figure this train out, and maybe it turns out she did us a favor. Maybe. You want to talk about that? Really sorry, Kitty. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore them. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be even. You should be, though. Get us free? Any ideas? You're asking me? What do I know about a train? More than me. Sorry, man. I'll okay. To Let's just get out of there. Uh... Can I wear rotten lunch? Mm. Alright, let's open it. Now let's pry the shit out of that. There. Hey Kenny, we're loose. <coughs> you touch any of my stuff? Yes. Cool. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. Hello, Charles. Drew outside? Yeah. And the guy yeah. in the cab. Him, too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. Sounds sick, dude. <laughs> to do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met oh, a guitar. Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. What? What's that normal about us? What? <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. you Welcome, good sir. Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry hmm. your son's not feeling good. I 
appreciate your concern. Well, with a little tea. Wait, can you have a bandage on your head? Fitters will fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got. Hmm. It ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. Hey, sweet pea. That candy Chuck gave you. It taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. <laughs> It's cool, huh? I guess. It's scary, kind of. Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Interesting. Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm -hmm. We still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. <laughs> That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. How you doing, Bill? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? Nah, yeah, quit your whining. I'm sorry about the RV. I'm worried. We're really on our own out here now. Well, we're putting some time into this train. Worst comes to worst. Boxcar safe enough to sleep in. I better get back to it. I mean, I think all we have to do is get on the train and that's it. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Yeah. Duck sick. Get on the train, Clementine. <laughs> Shit, man. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! You don't get Oh, I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. I'm the smart one. It's been nothing but dirty looks. Damn, turn around and walk really fast. God dang it. You gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
there were more of us. Dad, get him. No. Nope. All by the living, actually. Except for one. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Uh, 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 grab that, okay. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. I'm gonna go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. This train stopped right quick. Stopping the train. Stay put. Okay. <laughs> so whiny. Alright, let's get up there and stop him. This could escalate. Get your hands off me. I'm, I'm sorry. I just want to talk. We gotta stop this train because Cat needs you, Kenny. Doc doesn't have much time left. He'll be fine. Katja needs you, Kenny. Duck will be fine. No, we won't. Wake the fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't oh, you I wouldn't say it like that. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. Oh, fuck. Talk. <laughs> You need to lock it up. Be a man here. Oh, you want a piece of me? Is that it? Yeah, why not? Yeah, All right. Do. Let's do this shit. Wrong, somebody's got to knock some sense into you. Come on, man. Stop. Oh, fuck. I don't need you. And Duck doesn't need you. Not gonna happen, bitch. I don't wanna get you to stop this and you bet your ass I'm gonna. You don't even have a child! You don't know what this is like! You fuck you're not helping oh, my family! You're not helping Clementine! You're not helping anybody! Am I though? Oh crap, that one is actually really fast. Why do you hate me? <laughs> I've sided with you majority of the time.
gonna take as long as you need. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. God, you fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. You can't. I love you, Ken, but this is beyond you. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parents should have to do something like that. Yeah. He's I'll do it. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Believe you'd be doing this family a great service. Yeah. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Yep. Yeah. I know. What are you doing? I'm putting him out of his misery. Oh. Yeah, that's not fun. <laughs> what the? No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Uh, oh, God. Um. Get, get, gotcha. Uh. What? Why? Cat. Honey. Oh, fucking God. <laughs> you said you could do it, Cat. God damn it. You said you could do it. Oh, my God. I. I. That is just horrible. I'll do it. I'll do it. You don't have to. Thank you, Robin. For everything.
Damn it, game. Hey, how you doing? I don't care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Go she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna be. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? The sign the boat. boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. On the coast? Sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. I'm not a barber. It ain't gotta be styled, Jesus. You gotta run around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Very Find true. Some scissors in my pack, and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain to her how they work, and not to be afraid. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. Damn, man. You're, on to play. <laughs> You're homeless then. Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and well, they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. <laughs> Darn. I the kid, you know? I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Be safe up here. You betcha. Man, I don't even know if I should talk to him after that. Hey, hey, it'll be good to get to the water. It will. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure Cat would be uh, okay with you, so forget it. Hmm. Yeah. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Well, I mean, there's one right there. Can you pass it? You still want to get a vote? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. Yep, boat master. Of course it is.
We could have really damaged the train with that fight. Oh my god. Hey. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. What the there are fuck? Of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. Say Better be a bitch. Yeah. There's a drink there. Let's do that first. It's a fifth of whiskey. Wait, no one's actually watching her? What? Finish. No kid. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Yeah, you should probably get a drink, dude. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yep. Yeah. Let's get that map finally. Woo! Thanks. No problem, dude. It was me. You, uh... I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? Do you know how many people died because of that? It's all my fault. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me, kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still want to talk to me? Not really. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. That's, That's not going to fix anything, though. What are you doing out here? I uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. Not a good idea right now. Dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. See ya. Yeah. <laughs> See you. Hmm. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. Yep. Yeah. So he explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little, so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. 
good. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably headed pretty rough. Mm hmm Be careful around Ben. I like Ben. I know. He's just young. Doesn't make the best choices. I'm young. You're smart. Just listen to me, old man. <laughs> Be careful. Eight-year-old is smarter than him. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Nope. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? Squeeze the trigger. Steadily, okay? Don't give it a quick yank or pull. Steady. I can do that. Every time. It'll be tough, but just remember to do that. You'll hit what you're aiming at. Okay, I'm ready. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly, and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You should probably warn everyone else how you're doing that. You okay? Uh. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yes. Yeah, you do. Uh. And left. Aim a little bit more to the left. Aim higher. higher. There we go. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. To the right. Even a little higher. There you go. Nice. Can you get it in one try? That'd be epic. There we go. Yeah, you did. Good job. I squeezed the trigger, just like you said. I know. You did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. He's lived here a while. I hope we're not on this train much longer. Oh, here got time. Hey, Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is... Completely a bad. Team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay and, well, if they're not, what happened to them. I'm sure they're okay. Uh... Yeah, it's best not positive. That's what Dad always says. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they... What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... The Marsh House. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? 
once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty dessert. It's called the M... M... something... Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Uh, why not? Who cares? Haircut that now. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? <laughs> Are you saying it smells? No. Yes, it does. No. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it? And I got mad. Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't moan. It's a good thing. Do this. Mm. How hard can it be? I want to look like a boy. Shush now. So you did kill someone before. Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. No. It always matters though. yourself and to protect me I was sent to jail did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't all the time no. yep well, that's for sure I think I'm about done I can probably tie these pieces back with something here I have some hair thingies you do uh, yeah. yeah Lily gave them to me for sleeping there all set damn Lily <laughs> no, you look cute and a lot harder to grab. <laughs> All right, how do you feel? Good, better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! <laughs> Ah, oh, another roadblock. Shit. That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. <laughs> That's amazing. I, don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. A thing that's not mm. full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo! You keep screaming like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Uh. Could be. Who are you? 
Two people who have a strategic position on you. Come on, hun. Let's get this <laughs> right. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. Yep. But I don't yeah. think it'll be too bad. Let's get up there. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're Hello. Driving. Oh, man. Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! Yep. What? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Well, this is great! <laughs> See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? Might as well tell the truth there. Clementine alone. First day all of this happened, I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? <laughs> Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We don't well, that's okay. Help. We can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Alright, let's look around. Tape. That'll definitely help. That's about the only useful thing in here. It's empty. How do you know that? Alright, let's take a look at this. Bad boy. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? It's pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. So, yeah. Hi. Uh, again? The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And we'll yeah, sure. show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, kid? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Oh, Chuck's playing guitar again. I'm glad someone's managed to keep the spirit. All this power and we're still stuck. Got a clear view up there? Yeah, Damn. It was two o'clock in the day. That means he survived for like at least. Nope, it wasn't out. It was pretty long. He used to them. Yeah. Tough enough. It's you, me, and now Chuck. Who knows what these new people have planned? There are gonna be a lot more walkers to take care of. That's what I'm afraid of. I'm telling you, E. If they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just gonna 
punch my own ticket. Punch your own ticket? Yeah. Take myself out. Don't be dramatic. Damn. He's and tough on him all the time. Home. Learning the ropes? Can't be too hard, right? There are a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something were to happen to me, maybe we can drive in shifts. We'll see. Yeah. How have you two made it this far? <laughs> you seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups, and I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she takes care of you. Please. I've saved her ass hundreds, tens, sometimes. <laughs> How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while and then, you know. That's rough. So three months and then the apocalypse started. Talk to you later. Oh, uh, you left your cat behind? Teaching him anything? Damn. That sucks. Alright, let's get out of there. Interrogating this woman for us. Yep. She set off any alarm bells? Not yet. She's very thorough. That's <laughs> what I like to hear. All right, let's get to that station back there. Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Somebody must have been pretty dead. Survivors inside. Interesting. That paint has been dry for months. Yeah, that they're probably done for. Fine silver. Bunch of car companies. I mean, car repair companies. No entry. Well, a little wait for that. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Let's look at this forklift. Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Damn it. Okay. Shove. <clears throat> Won't burn. We'll have to find a way in. Right, boss. Well, right, let's check that out. Windows open. Yep, alright. That'll work out. Sounds good. Sounds horrible at the same time, but... Yeah. I can see in. What do I do now? Well, what do you see? Lock 
lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. How? Oh, is there like a latch up there? Well, I'll be damned. You okay? Uh huh. Let's go. Be careful. Well, of course. <laughs> Always careful. Oh yeah, there was a lock up there. Okay. That makes sense. Hold the door open. I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. Oh, yep, prop, I guess, with that. Damn it, my wrench. It's not really safe to do that either. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. Oh, a blowtorch. Let's get that. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> you should probably you check the area fence. first. Come on, scoot. Behind you! What the fuck? Oh my. Alright then. Gonna get to that wrench. Oh, back up. Grab it. Back away, dude. This is not your turkey, bitch. Everything's fine. Oh, there's one right there, just standing. Keys down. Oh man, if those keys weren't there. Nope, take it. Fuck, it's still locked. No shit, dude. Oh, wow. What the heck? No game over thing? Oh, okay then. Alright. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. Grab it. The hat. Go, go, go. Give me the gun. Take that, bitch. <sighs> God, no. It did not go nope. so good. Nope. Could have gone worse, though. Okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. found some walkers you and an eight-year-old versus three of them huh we handled it yeah it looks like what if you hadn't 
I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I hope you know what you're doing with her. I do. Me too. For her sake. Let's grab that blowtorch and run. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm a little shaky. It'll pass. They didn't have much business back then. We got it. Well, let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. <laughs> We learned not to be afraid. They should have got us, but we got them. Yeah, you're right. Fear is the thing that will kill us. You understand? Yeah, it will. Let's grab that blowtorch. Oh, we already did it. Let's go. Found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. <laughs> nope, can't go up there. that thing comes down we'll be on our way yeah and I hope we won't have any more trouble out of you I promise you won't mm, better hope that use tanker this would create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through damn right Why'd we grab the tape, though? <laughs> Think this'll work? Dude, you're cutting metal with fire. How could it not? Holes as a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Oh, there's a duct tape. There we go. Hope there's holes. Hopefully. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about. Yo, got you should hold me. So I don't fall. Whoa, thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. Oh yeah, let's force you to get do it. Out of my reach. You think it'll be within me? <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! <laughs> Damn it! That would be so horrible. Son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. Oh my god. There's our thousand walkers. Guys! There's something coming! What the what? Must be thousands. We gotta go! 
And yeah, that's not good. Only three months in and there's that many walkers. Kick that shit down. What the god this works. Holy crap. Probably won't do much stop. though. What? No way. Uh fine. You stay here and we'll go with your lady. <laughs> the hell you will. That'll make him jump. Oh my god. Get up, man. That's definitely not good. Oh. oh come on, Krista. Get up. There he is. <laughs> Hero. Oh crap, your leg, dude. It did nothing that fire. Are you hurt? No. We're okay. Speak for yourself. My leg is fucked. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. Another day gone by. Holy crap. I don't think I've ever realized that bridge. Whole city. Oh. Any duck and gotcha. <coughs> Next stop, the Atlantic. Yep. We're gonna find the boat. Everything's gonna be all right. We're finding Clementine's parents when we get there. I thought they were. Looking for them there. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. You'll be all right. I'll be alive, I guess. Blood in my heart. Blood in my brain, at least. I'll leave you to your thoughts. I don't think we should have said that. Like any of that. Old, like I've never seen. Fucking thing was broken. It was. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents, y'all might want to rethink your plan. Yep. Definitely have to after that. Well, there's the end. Forty percent, fifty-four. Hmm, interesting. Fifty-four percent fought him. God dang it!
but I don't know what to say about that choice though. Probably should have helped him, not gonna lie. Oh, no. Alright. I guess that's it for this stream. I'll try to do with the next episode tomorrow. Maybe complete the season by this week. I don't know. <sighs> See ya.